All right, Blackstreet TV, again, here, Grammy, Career Day at USC, and I'm here with the beautiful, talented Ndambi. Tell the fans out there, you know, what, uh, like, how did you get started? I'm just briefly, I know, we, can, I know okay. we can't go through all the ups and downs and all that stuff. I know it's been a long road for everybody. But the people out there that's looking to get careers in music, just tell them, like, what was your, your, your break in? Well, my break-in, basically, as most people, I started singing in church, and but my real break-in started as a background singer for Erica Badu. From there, I decided to do a solo career, and I put out some single solo albums on my own label. And then from there, I got signed to Stax Records, and now I'm an artist signed to Stax right now. Okay. Now, when you, when you are a backup or on tour with an artist or, and whatnot, do you pick up any of their flavor and style, or, or like little intricacies of what's working for them? Well, I think one of the things that happens when you're working with artists is there's a whole school of thought that goes with it and there's a lot to be learned. So you're going to learn a lot from the experience of music because there's no real specific school uh, to learn to be an artist, so, so to speak. Right. But you go in, you learn a lot, you see a lot, you grow, and then you're part of the creative circle. Mm -hmm. So you're, we, you, we're all vibing in inspiration and receiving inspiration and continuing to grow creatively. So. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, David, can you tell the fans where they could find find you and follow you, and do you do Twitter, Facebook, wherever they could sure. keep up? Sure. Uh, you can find me on www.ndambionline.com. That's N-D-A-M-B-I online.com. I'm also on Facebook and Twitter, so I'm definitely around in the social co networking community. All right. Well, thank you for your time. Thank you so much, Jamal. All right.